welcome back to another video here in the beautiful country of Oman. We are in Oman and we are cruising into Al Nuj, which is the Marsa district, the Buharia district, Gadir district, and Shati district. And as you can see, this is literally the uh, what uh, some would consider by some meaning me Malik al Modern Oman, the uh, king location of modern Oman. And we are taking you with us through here because we're going to a spot that the bartender had actually recommended to us or the server had recommended to us to go right near where we're staying at, which is the Kempinski Hotel. So we're coming up right on it right here. It is called Al Mul Muscat. And as you can see, we've got the walk right there. What do you think, Yala Habibi? Yala Habibi. And as always, we are with Habib T. Hello. So right in the back of this whole like subdivision area, there's actually a big parking lot. So if you're coming to this area and you want to go walk around, enjoy sunset here, there is a huge parking lot. I'm not sure if it's free, but I didn't see any signs to pay to park. So I guess we'll find out walking this way. Guys, I can tell you just walking out of the car, if I were to live in Muscat, I know for a fact, this is would literally be my neighborhood. I mean, if I can afford it, I don't know how much it costs, but it's ultra modern like nice balconies looking out this way. And I'm pretty sure that's the sea that close to it. And then right up here, we are about to get to the marina. Mm -hmm. All right, and we're arriving to the El Muj Marina. So let me put it this way. This is where the people that have the money live. Oh, <laughs> she almost fell. And yeah, right over this way, we've got a couple massive yachts over in this area. I would guess maybe that's like a yacht club or a bar or something, given that it's right up here against the coastline. We've got a sailing club, it looks like. And, oh, over there. That's what we've got to go check out. That's mm. what she was telling us about, the uh, food carts this way. Ah. So, yeah, guys, it seems like this whole area is like a brand new subdivision. I don't know specifically about the marina, but, I mean, you can see all of the architecture going up around the distance here new buildings new apartment complexes condos whatever they might be all in this area and a lot of things to do so i'm excited because we are pretty hungry we haven't eaten since uh, breakfast this morning and we heard these food carts over here have a lot of delicious options so we're going to be doing a little taste testing here and here we are guys we are arriving over to the food court we're going to have to do some testing but I would guess that since it is just about five, we're probably maybe 30 minutes from sunset. This place seems like it is a nighttime place because you have your rope lights up this way. And of course it's just still kind of hot out. But what do we have right here? We've got a double decker looking bus. Music. Oh, I see you grinding and dancing on the thing. Wanna jump up in my Lamborghini Gallardo. I don't know who's the singer now, me or my bed? <laughs> you. I think there's the uh, toilet that way, yeah, be. We've got a little Bisa. Psst, psst, psst. Bisa's talking to me. Oh, haram, she's skinny. Bisa. We're talking, we're communicating. Oh, she's coming to hang out. Hello, Bisa. All right, what do we got going on over here? Mango talat. Let's see what we've got. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hello, my friend. Hello, my friend. How are you? Fine, uh, Very good. Uh, what do you guys have here? Uh, smoothies? Yeah, smoothie, juice fresh, ice cream, oh. fruit salad. Mm, do you have like a strawberry banana smoothie? Yeah. What would you like? Medium large. Mm. Uh, medium for me, please. Only one. Uh, Do you have mango smoothie? Mango? Yeah. All right. mango. mango smoothie? All right, two smoothies then, please, boss. One, one is strawberry banana? Uh, yes, please. And one mango. Perfect. Yes. Medium, huh? Yes. yes. Where are you from? Egypt. Hey, Egypt. Yeah. Ah, Musar. Musala. Hey, Charafne Yachaye. Aviva. All right, so uh, we're going to be trying out some delicious smoothies to start out. Looks like we've got one, two, three, four, five, six different food stands here so a fair amount to uh, test out we're gonna start out with smoothies here move over next to the uh, it looks like it's a German Germany uh, styled food truck yeah I'm not sure what they serve there but we're about to find out after this one Thank you. Uh, we got the mango smoothie here mm -mm, good 
So these recipes are straight from Musar? Yeah. Oh, tamem, tamem. Rufiak kamen min Egypt? Yeah. Uh, uh, tamem. What's the right conjugation of Rafiak? Yeah, 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 that's Your right. Your friend, yeah? yeah. Tamem. <laughs> but I was gonna say, it's not Musar, it's Masar. Masar? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Ede betrid yasabe. Uh, uh, oh yeah, we've got ourselves a delicious smoothie we're gonna enjoy here. Waiting for you. Mm -mm, good. And we can tell you guys how much. 2.9. Hey guys, yeah, what that costs. So for two of these uh, smoothies right here down at the marina is gonna cost us about $7.53. So almost $4 per smoothie to have freshly made ice cold smoothies mm. oh yeah very delicious or as we say kilshi mm. taib mm. 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 oh that mango's really nice mm. Mm -mm, good mm -mm -mm. Kilshi Taib, Thank you. Shukran, Shufkun Ariban, Shufkun Ariban is ala arad. Okay. <laughs> See you. All right. Next up, we have uh, what do we got going on over here? Looks like it's called uh, Mento, and we've got oh, we got burgers, yeah, Edbe. Ho ho, yes. What do you think? Get a nice big juicy burger to share? Mm-hmm. I think you can't go wrong if we go for a... Uh, what do we got on here? We got burgers, we got chicken burgers, or we got sandwiches or munchies. So it looks like this right here, I think that translates to chili cheese fries, cheese fries, mm -hmm. and a portion of french fries. Wow, baby. You can read Arabic. <laughs> I didn't know that. Yeah. Mbala. And then, what do you think? Probably go for one of these just uh, typical uh, Angus burgers, double cheddar, mafi tomatoes, and add a fried egg on there too. I was looking at the same thing. Mmm, sahten. Oh, it looks like they must be open for breakfast too. Healthy breakfast. Hello, my friend. Hi. How are you? Good, and you? Good, always. Oh, very good. Love to hear that. Uh, can I please uh, have one beef burger? All right. Best beef burgers in the park, yeah? Sure. Oh, perfect, perfect. Anything else? Uh, yeah, just the beef burger, mafi tomatoes, and uh, uh, we'll add the fried egg, please. All right, thank you, my friend. How do we? How do I say thank you in the, the Philippines? Salamat. 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 All right. Salamat. So that means we're down to uh, two two trucks down after we finish this one, and we still got a couple more. This one's closed over here. How are we doing on sunlight? And oh, we've got our last moments. The sun's hidden behind the uh, construction building right over here. That's a nice vibe. And it looks like they even have some like ping pong tables or table tennis, depending on where you're from and how you call it. And a couple areas for uh, kids to play. Oh yeah, I can hear that burger sizzling right there. It's gonna be delicious, my friend. Thank you very much, brother. Oh, this looks fantastic. Mm, mm, mm. Look at that thing. Wow. That is going to be an absolute mouthgasm. All right, we've got this incredibly delicious looking burger, freshly made. Honestly, that's a fat burger. That is, on, that's like so big, that could fill up like two people and with a big thing of fries. Hopefully there's gonna be desserts in the other one. Mm, mm, mm. Well, let's soften it. For you on this? All right, let's get this little burger. By little, I mean massive. Chopped right in Haya. Oh, oh yeah. Hiya. Oh yes. That thing is ready for you to soften. Wow. Okay. Mm-mm good. Mm-mm. -mm -mm. Oh that thing. Cheers. Is... Oh yeah, guys, we're about to jump in. This thing is dripping all over. Cheers. Mmm. Burger cheers is the best type of cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, oh yeah. That is fantastic. Bun on the backside is a little soggy. Probably because it's very greasy. But it's got a nice. Mmm. Mm-hmm. A 
nice flavor to it. I think it's got some sauce on top that I can't figure out what type of sauce it is. Maybe like a mix of like ketchup, mayo, and something else. But it's really good. And then the uh, hot fried egg basically melting in with the cheese and the burger. That's a really good flavor to it. Mm, 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 mm. Hitting the spot, exactly what we needed. And you guys can't really see it, but the sun is just a few seconds away from setting, so no better time than enjoying a burger than at sunset when the weather's cooled down a bit. Mm, mm, mm. What do you think? Because you're a burger connoisseur now. Honestly, it's the best burger that I've ever had. Mm, that's a big statement. It's really good. The best burger you've ever had in your life? Yeah, probably. Wow. It's really good. I mean, I enjoyed it, but not even close to the best I've ever had. Oh. Because I'd give it a solid 8 out of 10, but the best burger is a statement. But you heard it here live. Yeah. Mm -mm. Fries are good. Literally freshly cooked. They're burning my mouth. I like the fries specifically from here because they've got a bit of seasoning and salt. And I prefer my fries to be pretty salty. There's a few places I've had fries recently that are like pretty much uh, with no salt on them. I like them loaded with salt. Mm -mm, good. All right, we've got uh, just a little bit of burger bun we're gonna share with Bisa. For you, Bisa? Ooh, a nice burger. Sahen, ya ruhe. Are you talking to me? Yeah, yeah you're talking. She thought I was talking to her. Sahen, sahen. Mm, enjoy that. It looks deeply. So it looks like Habib Day is uh, finishing up after this. She's saying, Kalas. But have no fear, Max Belly is here. <laughs> Let's see ya. I was walking over to the bathroom a minute ago and I came across some delicious looking food over here. So another burger place, fries, desserts, cold drinks. I think what's sticking out to me right now is the uh, Oreo milkshake for 1.5 Omani Real. Which is like $4 roughly. Looks like they've also got some teas here as well. And quite a few soft drinks. So let's uh, let's see what we can grab here. Hello, my friend. How are you? Alhamdulillah. You okay? Uh, Alhamdulillah. Welcome, my friend. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, where are you from? I'm from Zanzibar. Zanzibar. Oh, it's beautiful out down there, right? You know Be Zanzibar? Best beaches in the world. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. So very nice. Yeah, I'm coming from the U.S. U.S. Yeah, U.S. Hey, America. Hey, America, exactly. Yeah. Chicago. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Chicago. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know it, brother. You okay? Uh, so you got a delicious Oreo... Uh, Oreo milkshakes here? Oreo milkshake, yeah, and half. Oh, perfect. How many do you need? Two? Uh, we'll just do one today, please. Only one. <laughs> perfect, just one today, yeah. Uh, 1.5. All right, perfect. Thank you, brother. Oh, yeah, we got the Oreo milkshake all done. Milkshake. Thank you, brother. What was your name? Saleh. Saleh, thank you so much. Oh, this looks fantastic. We've got a bit of a uh, chocolate swirl going right around that. Mm mm mm. And the Oreo shake. This is already my second Oreo shake in Oman. I love these things. Let's see how this one compares. Mm. Looks like we've got a uh, hole right there. I'm gonna toss that right in. Boom. And let's test this one out. Oh, ho, 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 yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Very, very delicious. Mm, you can tell it's vanilla ice cream blended with the Oreos with a little bit of chocolate sauce in there to kind of give it that effect and mm, mm, good that's fantastic right over here at aluban so it seems like they've got um quite a maybe like an american menu i would say but one thing i've noticed if you look at the menu over there there's the cheetos chicken burger and i've seen that in a few places around Oman already with cheetos on the burger so i don't know if that's like a trend here or it's becoming a trend or what the deal is but mm. Mm. that's tasty though but honestly, it's about what you'd pay for, like, uh, something like this. In a city, usually. Probably a little bit cheaper than, like, um, New York City, D.C. Probably pay five or six for something like this. Here, about four U.S. dollars, so. I mean, it's a good price for being right here in the uh, marina. Try that. You're in heaven. Uh, indeed. When it comes to Oreo, there's always room for Oreo. <sighs> Let me guess, she's gonna say best Oreo shake she's ever had. No. <laughs> she's trying to pretend that uh, it's hers now, right? 
<laughs> no. Mm -hmm. Really good. Sahtan. And we have taken down the entire Oreo shake. I don't know how. Yeah, I do know how because it was freaking delicious. Oh my god. Could literally drink like three more of these. All right, and we've got one or two more food stands. Two more. We have the Owl Cafe, and then we have this one, Hut Food. What do you think? Get a little popcorn here. Hello, my friend. Yes, bro. How are you? Good, good. Oh, very good. So, what's the good stuff to get here? Oh, yeah, all, all types of stuff. Oh, thank you very much. Yes, sister. And we got chicken, falafel, French fries. Oh, um, thank you. Oh, I boneless chicken fettuccine, dynamite. Oh yeah, a lot of good options there. Mm. What do you want to do? Uh, start out with some popcorn. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Popcorn. Yeah, we just had a burger and a shake over there, so we're just gonna try some popcorn to start here. Only one popcorn. Uh, yes, please. Where are you from? From Tanzania. Tanzania? Yeah, Zanzibar. Zanzibar also. Ah, so you know him uh, over there, yeah? Yeah, yeah, nice guy. How long have you lived in Oman? Oman, I, le my, I like Oman uh, than Kato. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. And how many years do you live here? Ah, uh, two years. Two years? Oh, very nice. And do you welcome from? Uh, US and Lebanon. US? Yeah, USA. And uh, Lebanon. Lebanon. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How nice much? to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too, How brother. How long do you stay? Uh, eight days. Eight. A eight days in Oman. Eight. Uh, cool. Yeah, eight. eight. Uh, one eight. Uh, just eight. Many. Yeah, eight. 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 Yeah. Oh. yeah. Many years. Yeah, yeah. And how life is Oman? Oh, very nice. Really nice people here. Sure. It's a good time. And eight years not back at home? No, no, eight days. Eight. Days. Eight days, not years. Yeah, eight days, eight days. Eight yeah. Days. Just wondering, eight? Yeah, yeah, eight days. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Eighty yeah. years. And you? Mm -hmm. And you? Me? Yeah. I'm with him. So eight days. I'm flying back. <laughs> but your money is good? Oh, well, very good, yeah. Very nice. Thank you, brother. Yeah, it's a very nice country. How much you have? I have uh, half. Uh, give me, give me. What? Oh, is it half? Yes. Oh, okay. This. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Oh, inshallah, we meet again. Inshallah. Thank you, brother. Thank you. All right, here we go. We got some delicious popcorn. Mm -mm -mm. Where I can see this? YouTube. YouTube. Oh yeah, you know she's happy. She's grabbing that popcorn. Mm -hmm. Mm -mm, good. Not hungry. That's what we call delish. Yeah. We've got one more spot over here called Owl Cafe. What do you think? Finish off with some Karak Chai? Yes. Uh-huh. All right, little Karak Chai. I'll have to do the trick. Yep. Let's check out what's on the menu here. We have cold drinks, iced peach teas. Oh, we have, uh, they have iced peach teas here. Hi, there. Hot drinks, espresso. Uh, yeah, they do have Karak tea. You want Karak? Yeah, let's do that. Deal. All right. So guys, we're at the uh, Owl Cafe, and it looks like there's actually a spot up top. Oh. Are we able to sit up top? Hi. It's okay for us to go up? Yeah, yeah. All right, sure. thank you. Yala ya ruhe. We've got the uh, rooftop lounging over here. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah. Woo! It's a vibe. It's a vibe, it's a vibe, it's a vibe. Hey. Look at this. We've got yachts on one side. We've got the modern architecture lit up. We've got rope lights lighting up the food area. I'd say this is what we call a certified evening dinner vibe. And that uh, tea's gonna wash down nicely. We were gonna get karak chai, but they said it was gonna take a little bit of time to make, so we're actually gonna go ahead and have just some tea with milk. Mm-mm, good. Oh, yeah. Well, we've done some work on that popcorn. And now the last step of the meal. That means we'll have literally tried every single food cart cheers oh wait except that one way over there that wasn't open it's reopened <laughs> well it's their loss they should have opened earlier yeah mm, cheers, cheers. Mm. Mm, very good mm, mm, mm. Mm. that's fantastic my friends all right the chai has cooled down a bit now we can do a proper taste test mm, oh yeah we got that milky flavor like I said, they made like bag tea for us because we didn't want to wait too long for the uh, karak tea to be done. 
but it tastes very similar. Because basically it's like tea with milk in it. One of a kind taste. Oh, we got visitors it sounds like. Oh. All right, and I think our bellies are pretty full at this point. We're gonna do one quick walk this way guys and see what else we can show you. I believe this side's the fast food and then on the other side, that is the more high-end restaurants. All right, and we're passing the uh, hookah lounge right here. And now we're getting into the uh, higher end restaurants over here. Oh, and the lights came on when they heard my bell. My bellishka. <laughs> but yeah, welcome to the beautiful downtown area. This is ultra luxury. So it seems like this entire building is all under the brand name Hook, Hookah. I don't know if that has a similar meaning to Shisha or what. But we've got lights here. We've got a blue fountain going. And we even have a couple little small trucks here where you can buy some items. Clothes shopping at Ruhi? Maybe next time. Deal. All right, well, we've got uh, that cart. And then we also have a jewelry cart this way. A lot of nice shops. And if you have any more room in your stomach, there's a uh, cookie shop that way. Hello, my friend. All right, so let's see what else we've got down this way. So now we're seeing we've got basically some desserts all along this way. Some nicer restaurants over here. It kind of has that like Dubai, Qatar, super high end, everything fancy, everything luxurious type of feel here. And coming into here, oh yeah, it's just like Qatar in terms of like, even the uh, palm trees are lit up with beautiful lights. Oh, we've even got Yellow Cab Pizza. Oh, we have finally located it. She's been looking for this for so long. What? What? Wait for her to find it, guys. Starbucks. Starbucks? Oh, yeah. <laughs> her absolute favorite. I'm like, what? Where, where? The Bucks? The Bucks? Mm-hmm. Her number one favorite coffee spot in the world, Starbucks. They happen to have them in quite a few countries these days. Hey. Mm-hmm. And right across from it, we got the competitor, Caribou Coffee, the Crepe Cafe. So it seems like this place is good to go, whether it's the morning time or the evening time. Oh, they even have a Nando's here. Wow. Uh, it's Peruvian chicken. Oh. You ever had it? Oh, we got a lot of places to show you. And then further down here, we have Gloria Jeans and Sushi. So a lot of great options. I wonder if these uh, golf carts will take us back to the parking lot. Should we test it out? Oh, oh Baskin Robbins, you want ice cream, Yaruha? Oh my god. Oh yeah. What do you think? Hello, my friend. Hello. Are you able to take us over to the parking lot? What? Uh, parking? The parking? Yeah, thank you so much. Yellow? Yellow? Hey, here? Yeah. Where are you from, my friend? Bangladesh. Bangladesh. Ah, oh, very nice. I'm trying to get a visa there right now to go visit. Oh, I'm going to go for a little cruise now. Full speed ahead. Full speed ahead. Thank you. See Bye. you. All right. How long have you been living in Oman? Oman is good. Uh, how, how many years do you live here? Uh, eight years. Eight years, Eight years, wow. That's great. Oh, this is much better than walking right now. Mm -hmm. Now that we've got much the, uh, yeah, let the food digest, we'll go on for a cruise with the wind in the <laughs> face. <laughs> that is nice. It's just like when we were in Qatar. They, uh, when we were down at the park, they have the uh, golf buggy services to kind of take you around and get you around. A nice little uh, service to get us there. YOLO! Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's such a nice neighborhood here. Yeah, very nice. Oh. Whoa. Speed bump. Wow. <laughs> I didn't feel it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and we are almost there. Right. White Bugatti, please. Yeah, the white Bugatti. <laughs> it looks kind of like a Bugatti. Slightly different. Uh, uh, I think we're here. Yep, right here, brother. Thank you. Yep. Uh, Danivad. Thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See you, brother. Danivad. Hey, yeah. See you, Baya. Thank you. All right, guys, and we are back at the car. That is where we're going to conclude a nice little trip down here. Really hope you guys have enjoyed checking out this modern side of Oman and having a lot of delicious meals. Definitely, if you're in the area, you're going to want to come down to Al Muj. It is a nice time. So, guys, make sure that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of the other videos we're making here in Oman, and we will see you in the next video.